Welcome to the Baylor Kindness Studio. This is our first year student lecture. This is Lily Megan. Lily Megan. Crystal Pet. Yeah. Our wonderful cat. What's your name? Mary. Yeah. Okay, good. So, what are we doing today? Yeah, that's our first piano rehearsal. We just talked about how to work together with piano. All right, let's do it. Change the mood. Let's go to the second page louder. I'm sorry. Nope. Uh, you have a you have the transformation right here. What? Which is what? There it is. So okay, good. So what are you what are you looking at? Nothing. Sixteen tone subdivision, right? So you change the mood. You always constantly constantly looking for the subdivision.
And that's within the section. What do you want? Also the, and also the melody is much more stable than the because the mood and as well as uh, the right. So this is part this part aria of that piece. So I think the long note. What happens if you uh, think that you can play those notes? Vibrato, yes, of course, we don't use vibrato for that, okay? So what do we do? Much more here, that's right. And also, especially, can you play the, the chord, the third bar of the chord? Which one are you? Similar pattern, so I will come from Rome. Okay, next part. What kind of mood is that? Not so happy or why? Why? Exactly. <laughs> you 
move from minor to that's right, minor to major. So basically, he's converting between G minor G G major, which is counter to F minor G and counter to F minor G minor. So I just want to remind you that F minor G is bad. Okay, it's a gothic sound. F is another five of minor four. You can do it under minor, but next part is. Okay, good. Let's do that. Don't worry. That's right. Even more. Sometimes, third grade to do you need to go that much for the third grade. Okay. So, oh, I see. So that's just that uh, if you want me to edit that part, I can edit it. Okay. Good job. I like to do it. Now, this is one particular part. Okay. Nothing, it's not your fault. However, it's Lee's fault. He's the soprano. Why I think. Yes, for some other reason, you might not hear it here. But for that particular reason, which I will explain to you in the next song. <laughs> yeah, but I really like this song. You know, I know it's not going to have the same kind of power as the other one. But it's okay. So what can you say to be the number one? Good. Good. That means if you can keep writing, then I will suggest to you to have them work. Okay. Have some feel you have them. In the future, when your body is a little strong, you might have to do a little bit of this and this. But it's normal. It's very normal. Okay? It's normal to do uh, a little bit of this and this. 
good. So we play back here because it's easy. Okay, now, no problem. Now, next section. Next you next next section also is quite easy. Sometimes not only the piano always go with you. So that means one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, six. Yeah, six or seven. You have to do bigger piano because the piano is going with you. Okay. Now, on the contrary, at measure one seventy, you don't want to do more crescendo. Is there a do you crescendo with me? With her? Yeah, a little bit. But not too much, right? Because uh, if you you only have four notes. If you're not that important, I'm sorry. <laughs> so you, if you play a compliment, give her dynamic the middle forte. With if you don't have anything at the same time with the piano. So 178, try to have forte. You don't have to play middle piano with her. No one's more than the middle piano. Okay? That's that's the most important thing. Yeah. And then we play a style.